The boat market's hot right now, which might make you want to sell your boat. Here's how to do it. These are the five must do things to get top dollar for your boat right now. First, clean it. Pamper your boat. If you take care of it, it's going to take care of you. Cha-ching! It takes a decent amount of time and the right tools, but you can take an old rugged looking boat like this and turn it into a nice shiny boat like this. If you don't want to do this work yourself, then hire somebody. It'll be worth it to get top dollar for your boat. Second, take some nice photos and videos. Once your boat is all pampered and clean, take some photos and videos. When you go to take photos of your boat, take it to an open parking lot, like a high school or a church parking lot, where all the focus can be on the boat. You want to make sure that the lighting is good. So use the first couple of hours of light in the morning or the last couple of hours of light in the evening. With your photos and your videos, make sure that you showcase both the good and the bad. Make sure you max out on the number of photos and videos that you take. Any left over, you can always share with a potential buyer. Here's some pictures you definitely should take. A nice side shot. A good shot of the interior. Take a nice picture of the underwater gear. Have some nice shots of any of the upgrades you have. On this boat, you have fresh air exhaust, you have a plumbed in ballast, and you have perfect pass, along with wakeboard tower and wakeboard racks. Get a good shot of the tire tread. My personal favorite, get a good shot of the surf wave. Most likely a video would be best. Buyers would also like to see a shot of the number of hours your boat has, along with the capacity placard, like this. Give a nice shot of the engine and some of the different storage compartments. Third, write up a nice and accurate description. Think of it like a dating profile. You don't want your whole life story there, but you also don't just want a one-liner either. Remember, you want to build trust with your potential buyers. Just remember to highlight any upgrades on your boat, along with any of the problems that it might have. Some upgrades that I would highlight on this boat. This boat has perfect pass, has plumbed in ballast, has a new water circulation pump, it has a fresh air exhaust, it has a wired nav light to the top of the wakeboard tower, it has a wakeboard tower, and it has board racks. This boat has a couple gel coat problems, like right here, right here, or here by the glove box. All of these things happened prior to us owning the boat. Because they're above the waterline, I just haven't put much emphasis on fixing them. Also, this interior isn't in the best shape ever. I think some of these pieces are actually from the factory. A couple of them have been redone, but most of them are cracking, which is on par with a boat that's almost 30 years old. It might last another season before you'd have to replace it. This seat base right here is cracked all the way down. It's a typical break in a nautique of this era. If you want to add some humor to it, you could write up something like this. Here's your typical 90s boat. Purple interior mixed with purple and magenta outside. Bring your own burn CD from your favorite boy band and rock out in this 1995 nautique super sport. But this is the best place for you to feel like your high school self again. A bit courageous and awkward all at the same time. It actually serves really great for a boat of the 90s. This has the Ford GT40 engine in it. Probably the same engine that was in the famous OJ Simpson Ford Bronco. On another note, this will be a fantastic boat for you and your family. Fourth, price it right. The market's hot right now, but there are some resources out there to help you figure out what you should sell your boat for. My favorite is onlyinboards.com. They actually give data and information on recently sold boats. Just click this tab right here. This is a Nautique Supersport which is similar to a Super Air Nautique 210. I'm going to list it for about $25,000. This boat is perfectly set up for wakeboarding or wake surfing. Now that you have pictures, description, and pricing, make sure you list it in the right spot. Facebook Marketplace has become a very good place to sell boats. Onlyinboards.com is another great resource with a wider reach, but some of the best places I have seen to sell boats are in boat-specific groups on Facebook. In these groups, as long as you follow the rules, you can list your boat for sale within those groups. Typically, they want you to have a price for the boat along with location and what year and make it is. Like this group right here, Nautique Boat Owners. I'm gonna list my boat in this group. You can contact me through the comments below or on Facebook. This boat has been great for our family and we'll be sad to see it go, but we just need to make room for what we're getting next. If you're also making room for a new boat, you might wanna use this wake boat comparison tool surf select. Click right here to see how. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.